Like he's already, I'm done with it. I'm not drinking from the fruit of the vine until the kingdom of God comes. Like I'm done. I ain't asking for wine when I'm saying I'm thirsty. Then what's he asking for? I'm telling you, Jesus is on that cross and he's saying I'm thirsty for what? For a change. Like he came to do something. He came to make a change in this world, to leave a mark, to give a way back home for his sons and daughters. He came and when he says I'm thirsty on that cross, what he's saying is I'm thirsty that this crowd of wickedness right here, the one that was yelling, crucify him, crucify him, might be changed into um, sons of righteousness by the power of God. I'm thirsty for something else. And I'm willing to do whatever it takes to bring it to pass. I'm thirsty. For what? For darkness to turn into light. For hearts of stone to become hearts of flesh. For slaves of sin to be sons of God. I'm thirsty. And that's what he's, he's crying out his heart here. He's wanting to see a change because heaven sent him on mission with purpose that he might be the redeemer, that he might be the sacrifice given to what? To change everything. And he's crying up on that cross, I'm thirsty. And that's a beautiful cry.